Hey YouTubers, welcome back to another episode here on ESGN Net of MLB 13, the show, Road to the Show with Theo Bonds. This is episode 68, and as you see here, we're looking at some uh, league leader numbers uh, so far. We're getting close towards the end of the month of August, getting ready for the last month of the season, uh, which... Uh, it's better known as a stretch, uh, the month of September. Uh, but as we go into September, as you see here, uh, Theo, uh, as, you know, as you see, his batting average is uh, 368. Uh, and we'll see his home runs. Uh, as you see there on the other, on the, on the right side of the screen, uh, 54 R, uh, 54 home runs, 100 RBIs, uh, and there you see his doubles. He has 21 doubles for the season so far. And we'll go ahead and look at some other stats. If you guys see your favorite players or whatever, just pause the video, take a look at the numbers. I'm not really going to get into those guys' uh, numbers per se. Uh, but there you see uh, just 19 RBIs behind the uh, American League leader. Uh, he, and, of course, he would, I think he would love to have that and the home run record and the RBI record and be a triple crown winner. Um, so, but, you know, you never know. We've got enough time for that to happen uh, but as you know we're going to go out west to the play the, against the Dodgers and of course uh, we'll see what they'll say uh, you see the current standings in the National League Central but before we get on the field and see Theo play let's go upstairs with Matt Verscursion and the MLB crew and as they have a Tops player spotlight video about our star Theo Bonds take it away guys Welcome back. I'm Matt Vaskirchen here on the MLB pregame show. As we draw closer to the first pitch in this series opener, let's have a look at our Topps player spotlight. Theo Bonds is in the glow. And he's been doing this seemingly since he first came to the big leagues, consistently doing whatever his team has asked him to do. No question, Matt. You know, this guy has been terrific since reaching the major leagues. And I think this club would like to find a way to clone this guy because he definitely is the kind of guy you want on your team. He's still young and he has some things to learn, but I predict that his game is only going to continue to grow. And if it does, he's going to be an exciting guy to watch for a long time to come. All right, lineups and first pitch are coming up next. Stay tuned for that right here on the show. Okay, so... Pretty much the guys in the booth uh, pretty much say that uh, Theo Bonds is going to be the future of uh, not just the Cardinals, but also Major League Baseball. So hopefully that's true uh, as we see as we get ready to play against the Dodgers here in a three-game series uh, here at Dodger Stadium. And as of course, uh, like I said earlier, we're going to be going against a great pitcher by the name of Josh Beck, of course, uh, two-time uh, World Series uh, champion for the Boston Red Sox and also for the Miami or, or, or I should say Florida Marlins back in the day. Uh, but there you see uh, at that first at bat he whiffs at that one so Becca gets his number against Bonds at that first at bat so uh, there you see a strikeout for Theo Bonds. Top of the fourth now uh, runner at first and one out and here we go Bonds uh, swings and gets that one, and that one gets dribbled down to the sh shortstop who gets the double play there. You see Gonzalez at first getting the ball and um, tagging the bag there to get Bonds out. So top of the seventh now. We're trailing by two. Runner at second and with one out, and then you see a fly ball right there, and Bonds is out. As you see, uh, he is not having a good day so far here. Uh, he's 0 for 3 already. And we'll see in the replay here, uh, Beckett is definitely uh, has done his homework against uh, Bonds here, uh, watching video and stuff to see uh, there. You see Matt Kemp getting the ball and getting the fly out there on Bonds. So top of the ninth here, no uh, one out or nobody out, and one at second. There you see a strikeout there by Bonds. And so again, another strikeout there. And, of course, Josh Beckett. Uh, really doing his homework while watching video, or excuse me, not Becca, the closer there, um, gets uh, the, uh, doing the homework on Bonds, you see 0 for 4, and then you see Mike Matheny not too happy with his team, and especially Bonds, and of course Becca gets his 10th win of the season. So we move on to game 2 here uh, in this uh, three game set, there you see 76 and 52, and of course there you see the Los Angeles Dodgers just playing just above 
500 there. And then we'll go ahead and get to a full count at the top of the first. There you see Bond uh, swings and misses that pitch. Ends up striking out once again. So that's his third strikeout in this series. Top of the fourth here with a 2-2 pitch. And again, that drop third uh, third uh, strikeout right there. Uh, throws Bonds out there uh, at uh, first base and gets him out. So top of the six now, we're trailing by three. Nobody on board, two outs, and that one you see the shortstop getting there on time and getting the ball and, and uh, getting that uh, uh, hit right there and uh, causing Bonds to uh, not get on board again. So top of the eighth here, Bonds finally gets a hit here, and uh, so he's not going to be – oh, he gets, his, I believe, his second hit of the day. And uh, not uh, too bad of a game, but uh, you know, of course, uh, we see here, uh, yeah, inner half of the play right there, and he gets the ball and ends up uh, hitting the ball uh, very well. I believe that. Well, actually, no, I take that back. That's his uh, first uh, at bat here uh, for this or for his first uh, time on the bases in this game. So now we go to the top of the ninth here. Bases are loaded, two outs. It's a 5-5 game. Would it be nice to break this tie? And that ball is going deep. That ball is deep. It's it's gone. It is Theo Bonds' second Grand Slam of the year. That is his 55th home run. A Grand Slam home run. That puts the Cardinals now at 9-5 to five in this ball game. As you see there, third base coach giving him some love there. And there you see the guys sitting there. Thanks, man, bringing us home and getting us, hopefully, this win. There you see, talking about a hit right there. Uh, all that pent-up uh, aggression and, and just being upset because he couldn't do nothing in the first game of this series, going for over 4 and getting two strikeouts. Bonds goes deep and actually helps win the game. There you see, 9-6. to six. Uh, Mitchell Box gets his uh, fifth win of the year. Jason Mott gets his 42nd save of the year. And there you see, player of the game. Uh, in so many episodes uh, before, we've seen him play, get player of the game here uh, in the Topps rookie card there. Theo Bonds once again, uh, player of the game, hitting that monster grand slam uh, with his second uh, time or his fifth time at the plate. And his second time uh, being able to get on the bases there. This one goes deep and long for a grand slam. His second grand slam of the season already. And uh, so, I mean, good things are happening for him uh, so far in this, uh, uh, for this first year. So we go ahead and go to game three, which actually we end up, uh, he ended up getting a day off. And they win this uh, game 10-3 to win. So we actually finally win a series unlike... Uh, the uh, Marlins series, or I actually know the Marlins series, we actually uh, split with. Uh, but of course, you know, if, as of late, uh, we've been uh, kind of slack when it comes to winning series. Uh, we've been winning a series uh, just by, um, you know, a series here, and then you know, two series later, we'll win another one. So hopefully, that'll change around when we head our way to the Rockies here as we get ready to play uh, the Colorado Rockies there at Coors Field. Um, and uh, we'll see if uh, Theo can uh, continue the home run derby there uh, as he has now 55 home runs and I believe about 100 and so um, RBI. So uh, you guys come on back for episode 69. And like I said, as we go to Colorado to play against the Rockies. As always, you guys, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Uh, also, follow us on Facebook and uh, also on Twitter, and check out our Tumblr page, you guys. All those links are down below, and in, they're in the description. And also check out the other series here on ESGN Net. As always, you guys, keep yourselves healthy, and I'll see you guys next time here on ESGN Net.